Welcome back guys. Before we start our fishing video today, just want to give a quick shout out to this company, uh, Placino, Plusino, Placino. I'm not really sure how to pronounce it, but one of the ways should be correct. Uh, they reached out to us and then asked if we want to review one of the product. So they ended up sending us a raw rack. So before we start today, I just want to go ahead and assemble this and see how it works. As you can see currently, I don't have a good raw rack, so I think this should be a, a great benefit for me for storage wise in the garage. Let me show you guys my uh, DIY rack that I have for the last 10 years. PVC pipe. Not the best, but you know, it works. But I do need to be, it, I do need to replace it. It only holds 8 rods. This one holds 12 rods, so let's go ahead and assemble it and see how well it works. I don't know what's in there. I haven't opened it yet. It's brand new. I just got it a few days ago. I haven't opened it yet, so. Let's go ahead and open it together and put it together. I have my trusty Rambo knife here. This away. All right. Let's see what's in there. So L wrench, two screws, centerpiece. Pretty simple to assemble, it looks like. So it has three pieces to it and two screws, so. Pretty straightforward. And. Screw from the bottom. All right, it's tight. Make sure it lines up. Make sure the hose lines up. All right. Okay, pretty simple. Two screw, three pieces, bottom top, and the center piece. All right, let's put a rod in there, see how well we we'll set. It's gonna be saving me a lot of space and making sure my rod doesn't get damaged because I know. I had damaged a few reels just throwing it up in the pile over here. I guess I could take out this old PVC rod hole that I created. I might have to order another one because I do have more rods. So. That's pretty nice. I like it. I think I'm going to order another one so I can put it right next to it. Alright, thank you Placino. Appreciate that you sent me out this. It's a great item, guys, for the price. It's not too expensive. So you guys want one, go ahead and order it. I'll go ahead and put their website in the description of this video. So, all right, guys, let's get to the fishing. Yes, today is raining, but when you only get a fish on a certain day, can't be choosy.
there we go first one today it's not big but this is a bfs rail so we'll play with it good one let's go on for the first one of the day Take it. Fourteen, thirteen. Thank you for the fight. There we go. Sounds like a big one. I'm doing good guys, green, the green tackle jig. Like 13 and a half. Got it. The same spot. Sixty feet. That was a good bass.
60 feet guys Keep her at least third one of the day All right, guys. It's almost time to go. Sun's in the own settings. Four o'clock. I have about thirty minutes left. On my GoPro. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to catch another one, but so far we got three fish. Right where we uh, stopped the last time we were here as well. Uh, I was able to catch one here today just a bass though the crappies are here but they're kind of finicky they're not biting right now they're still in that 57 feet of this rock right here they're hugging the bottom so that's part of why i didn't see any fish today Go back to where we started. Let's go fish the marina and then call it a day.